Um, uh, there, a story came out with Marvin Harrison Jr. saying that he's 50-50 on going to the NFL. Uh, they're saying that some of the boosters are, are going to try to offer him the same amount of NIL money as he would get it on the rookie contract. And he also said that he wants to stay and beat Michigan. So he's on the fence with this. So, Adrian, what do you think Marvin Harrison Jr. should do? Should he go back to college or should he go to the NFL? Marvin Harrison Jr. should not think twice about going back to college. He needs to enter the NFL draft. It's really about that second contract, not that first contract. He goes into the league, ball, balls off, balls hard for three years. He'll get a rookie extension. He'll get $30, $25, 30000000 million a year, not from NIL. And I think a lot of this is just these boosters um, – He's trying to geek his, geek his head up. There's no way he's making – he's going to make $20 million a year. Um, and even if he does, we don't even know what the Ohio State roster is going to look like. We don't even know who's playing quarterback for him at this point. If they got if they have the quarterbacks I think they're going to have and not get a transfer, I don't see them winning a national title next year. Um, so, I know they got some young receivers and stuff. But I think it's just him just talking and being emotional about, you know, his time coming to an end in Columbus. So, no, go to, go to the NFL and be, and be, a, and be a superstar. Yeah, I agree. I mean, I don't think even, even – I just don't, don't understand why Ohio State, even if it is true, like it's still all rumors, but why would you promise a kid $20, 25000000 million in NIL money when you can spread that out across your whole team and you can get a superstar quarterback and another wide receiver and, um, you know, possibly recruit – what's that kid's name? I can't think of him. Um, he's pretty committed to Ohio State. Uh, I don't know. No, the wide receiver. He's a, he's a, going to be a freshman next year. He already committed to Ohio oh, State. Uh, sure. Jeremiah, Jeremiah Smith. Yeah, didn't he commit to Ohio State? Yeah, he's committed right now. They're trying to flip him, though. Then there's a rumor because he was wearing Florida State gloves. He might come yeah. to Florida State, which would be sick. Um, but, yeah, I don't know why you wouldn't just take the – why you wouldn't just go to the to the um, NFL. Sure, your rookie contract, it stinks. You have way more – the NFL as a player, you don't have to worry about all this other stuff but like you do in college. Um, you're basically your own entity anyway. You can not just make your rookie contract, but how many people do you think are going to come at him for sponsorships and all this stuff that he can make for marketing outside? I mean, look at like Justin Jefferson, what he does. He got millions of your team in every other commercial, or you see guys like uh, Patrick Mahomes and the State Farm commercials, like. Companies throw money at you like you couldn't even imagine that would be worth more than your NIL money. If you want to beat Michigan um, and win a Big Ten championship and that's like your biggest thing that you want to do, sure, I guess do it. I think it's dumb. Um, you're going to be a top five pick regardless, top three pick actually regardless. Um, so, yeah, I, I would not – I wouldn't stay. I mean, I guess beating your college team still stretches into the pros because a lot of guys do the bets and stuff. But go to the NFL, dude. Go make go make more money than you could even imagine in the NFL than you would at NIL college. Yeah, agree. He, he needs to go to the NFL. And then football is such a violent sport. You don't know in, in, any day you could blow a knee out. Anything could go wrong. So he has a significant inj- injury. He's obviously a top two, top three pick in this in, the, in uh, the upcoming draft. He gets some type of injury, second, third round. Like look at Jordan Travis. I think Jordan Travis would have been probably a second rounder. He's probably not going to go to about the fifth now. So yeah, he, he needs, he needs to leave, go get his money. I know it's frustrating. He hasn't beat Michigan, but no, nah, just, yeah, he should leave. He should go to the NFL. Even, even CJ Stroud, CJ Stroud never beat Michigan either. I know that was frustrating for him, but he left his junior year. So yeah, well, you know, you, you got opportunity. And he's going to get paid if he keeps playing the way that he plays too. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. You, you got a chance to be a top three, top five pick in the NFL NBA, NHL, any, any any draft, go, just just go, go go professional. 